Hello everyone, welcome to Phasmophobia. So, I've said we were going to go on to the small maps on Nightmare, and I haven't actually gone to Point Hope on Nightmare yet, so I said let's try Point Hope on Nightmare with the Blood Moon. Now before we go in there, I wanted to show you, we need to escape and prevent. I don't know where the breaker is, so I'm going to go in with the thermometer, the EMF, and actually a lantern, and then my headlamp. So I think I'll be good with this. But as I go in here, I want to mention, thank you so much for 200 subscribers plus. I have, it keeps going, and also thank you for the feedback on the video. And it seems like, yes, a lot of you do want me to stream. So I do have a lead on the fixing the problem I had, so I need to do some more test streaming. So I do think streams are going to be in the future. But for now, we're going to be continuing on doing more videos and also just enjoying the Blood Moons while they're st still here. Now, we are really close to the next level, and huh, you know, and we do have a week and a half left or so, so I think we'll get there. I should be focusing on just going and getting the... Oh, I should be using this too. But I'm going to get the breaker turned on, and then we're going to wait for uh, the temperature to go up. Now, I kind of forgot about the moons that are going to be around here. But I wanted to get the breaker on as quickly as possible, and then I will roam around. But that's why I had the lantern. See, I don't have my camera, so maybe at some point I'll come back for these. Now, I think the highest point that the breaker could be is right here. So, did I miss the breaker? I may have just missed it. So, is this the... Yeah, I think this is the highest floor. I just heard something. Are you in here? Where's my EMF? Oh my god, you were... I just ran into the ghost... That's that. Oh. Wait, how? Did you set this off or was this always going off? This is the mirror or something you threw. Was that always going off? I've never noticed that. Oh, I guess maybe you touched this? Alright, we have a general idea of the ghost room. Let's keep roaming. I'm actually going to go back down. I feel like I just walked right past the breaker. Let me just run down here and see. I should keep my sanity up with this lantern. I'm pretty sure they changed it on Point Hope where it can't be any higher than that floor. Did I really just pass the breaker? Was it on the first floor? Oh, maybe it's in the other... Wow. There is one other spot that I never think to check. I thought that was the summoning circle. Is it in here? Yes, oh my god. I never think to check if the breaker's right here. I really need to do that. I mean, I could have walked right in here and checked. But the thing is, we already know where the ghost is. So, what about the cursed item? I kind of wanted to play around with the cursed item, but since we're on Nightmare, Maybe we'll just have a fun game. I need to escape the ghost, so no matter what, we're going to be getting hunted. There's a hiding spot. I didn't really look around too much in the f first floor if there was a room or the, a hiding spot. And also, I don't know what, about this cursed item. I only really checked two rooms. I guess I'm, this is why I wanted my lantern, so I could walk around and not worry about my sanity. Okay, I'm actually going to find the cursed item just because... Is there a hiding spot in here for me? Oh, there I hear that damn clock up there. There's a bone. Should I just take the bone? I don't think I'm going to go for a perfect game. So, I don't think... Do you need a photo of the bone for a perfect game? I know you need to pick up the bone, but I don't know if you need a photo of it. Alright, ghost. I hear you in here, calling me with your chimes. What is going on with that? Oh, it like fell over. What are... Is that even a noise from the ghost? Let's check the temperature, because I see my breath. No way. Is this a hunt or not? Okay, it was not. <laughs> there was no way I was in hunt range unless it was a demon. So, I mean, it was every possibility. Oh boy. So. Okay, so I guess that was the Oni Ghost Ball, so not Oni. I need to be kind of paying attention here now. Was that two ghost events right back? At least give me EMF 5 off this. I can't take any photos. Well, I wanted to get EMF or freezing. Oh my god, you're doing so much stuff in here. I don't think it's going to be going down to freezing. Let's pick this back up. Light it. And then, was this EMF 5? Oh, is there no... Oh, I guess this is just what it looks like when there's no hiding spot here. I thought this was, like, the cabinet. But that's in the floor below. What was that? 
Oh, it was <laughs> the light. That's what I thought it was, but I didn't know there was even a light over here. Okay, turn on a light, so not a mirror. So actually, you're doing stuff that at least tells me something. But I should probably... That was one thing. Okay. Super active ghost again, and it's not an Oni. We already know. Then I'm going to just leave. I kind of want to look upstairs for a hiding spot. So I'm going to drop this down here. That was not very nice. Let me take this upstairs. And I'm just going to look for a hiding spot that I could use upstairs rather than downstairs if I have to go that way. And yeah, it looks like I'm going to be avoiding this room. Now I have to escape. That means the ghost is definitely going to have to see me. So, uh, doing that with the uh, staircase is so hard. So I think that'll be my hiding spot ultimately. Did we find that cursed item? I don't even think I did. Was it the Voodoo doll in here? Oh god, if I found it I've already forgotten. I don't think I did. Maybe it was the music box sitting right here. Yeah, I hear you. And it is the music box. You can ghost had to be in the same room. I don't think that was even at 5. With the new sound, we definitely hear it. Alright, ghost. Oh, was that the breaker? Yeah, because you didn't... See, there was a light on back here. Unless you did turn this off. Okay, I, I guess you did turn it off and I didn't hear the light. Alright, well, it's not going down to freezing yet. So, uh, let me just get back in here with some other stuff. That was my lantern. Well, as usual, it always seems like the best bet for getting away is just running down the stairs. I mean, hiding behind the table there is very good. And maybe you could get a chance to run away. Are you hunting? What? Oh my god, you are. I thought I heard crying. Okay, I'm gonna go to the first floor and hope I had a hiding spot. I know I did. Well, okay, I guess it's time to take sanity. But what? Uh, well, we had two ghost events. But what could this ghost be? Where we're already getting hunted and I've been, you know, hanging out with that lantern for a while. God, the blood went on here. It looks so crazy. Oh my god, you can even see the light, I guess. It's so funny. When you go up the... The... All the stairs, I don't really ever pay attention to what side the... Windows are on. Uh, well, we can't see sanity, so I'm just gonna take one. Can I take another? Yes. So I guess this is gonna be 25. Uh, can I take another? Yeah, looks like we're going all the way back up. I have no idea. How could I? I must be like at max now. So I just want to get evidence stuff in there. Let's get a book for writing dots and this and we'll just set it up. I guess I want to take it on the tripod. So I'm going to be going in there and just hope, hoping my high sanity protects me until later on. I want to figure out what this ghost is before we get hunted by it. Well, it's a nightmare, so I at least want to get the evidence. I don't know if we'll figure it out. Alright, I am hoping that all that sanity is paying off. I'm ultimately just staying in the dark. I'm not going to be able to touch this light. So there, drop the thing first. I guess I could run back there if I need to, but I'm really just going to try and run to the first floor if I get hunted. Yeah, got to drop that first. <clears throat> oh, okay, I can't open the door. Show me your ghost orbs. Oh! Thank you. There it is. So, what does this seem like? Not a Hantu. Well, I think... Would a Hantu always have freezing, or is it... Put this down. EMF. What are these noises? Ah, uh, do I just put this down? Turn that light back on, please. I'm gonna have this dots in the room now. Like, pause it there. That looks perfect. Please, maybe light this back. Give us a sign. I know you've been super active. Time to stand in the dots again. Whoa, I don't like Banshee, Revenant, Hantu. You really are turning off the light, but we know you're not a mayor. Should I keep the light off? No, because I want my sanity. Well, we got the ghost orb. I guess I should just leave. Oh, check freezing again. <sighs> if it's not down to freezing, though. Mm. No, I think it's... Wow, I mean... I learned from a comment that if it goes under 1, it's freezing, but it, it went down to 1.1, so I don't think it's going to be fr <laughs> freezing. Again with these shadows. Okay, there you are. You're not as big as I thought you were. I'm going to place this dead center. Still no EMF 5. You really want to drain my sanity. What could this ghost be where it's draining so much sanity? 
I don't even know what I could do. I'm trying to think of what ghosts have guaranteed evidence. And of course, I'm not really getting anything. Was that me? What made that noise? I should just run. Let's make sure there's nothing else in my inventory. I'm going to leave and uh, I gotta get a crucifix smudge. I need to start preparing because it's draining my sanity fast again. What in here would be draining my sanity a lot? Uh, I have no idea. Okay, well, it let me out. Oh, wow, we're not being hunted yet. Uh, okay, I think I'm going to leave my last one thing of sanity. I mean, I might as well take it if I'm still up there looking for stuff. Now, the thing is, I could still look for dots. It's not going to be Goryo dots, but if I wanted to play this smart, I would just sit here and look for dots. Man, that is covering the entire room. Let's just sit here for a little bit and look for dots. Well, all right, as cool as it, was be, as it would be to see dots in here... It's moved two things, so it's been in the dots, and it's not gone off. And I'm pretty sure it's all, like every 30 seconds or something, there's a chance for it to go into its dots form. So I, we really haven't been waiting here long enough, it may have just turned off the breaker. I think, it, I don't know. On Blood Moon, it's always, the lights are always on out here. But I'm gonna go ahead and say it's not dots, but it's, you know, nightmare. So we can't rule it out. But I'm gonna go ahead and get back in there. I'm gonna get the at least one smudge and a crucifix. Yeah, we need that. Then, yeah, okay, I guess I'll be in ultimately getting all the objectives. But maybe it'll tell me what this ghost is. I don't know, maybe it's a Thay. It's been very active. Is this gonna be another Thay? Yeah, I mean, with how active it is. Oh, also, it could have been an Onryo, and it's been blowing out the candle. It doesn't, I don't think it's been blowing it out a lot compared to a normal ghost. But it could be an Onryo, so we gotta get a crucifix in there. I could have blown out the lantern when I wasn't in there and started a hunt. Alright, I already have this. One crucifix. And then... I mean, it hasn't been touching the door. How many... Would be three versus the UV. I wonder if it could also be three. Uh, I guess I'll just take the spirit box and then I'll come back with UV and salt. Oh, I'm gonna take the last thing so I have a little bit of time. Maybe, see that's why, maybe I shouldn't take the smudge, I know it's dumb, but I'm actually not going to take the smudge, and I'm going to take the two last evidence that I need, so that way I'll try and maybe focus on getting them, and narrowing this down before getting hunted, but it could be a Raiju, but we didn't get dots, and I think a Raiju, well, could be EMF5, and I haven't been getting EMF5 even with all the stuff in there, so, I don't know, <laughs> let this one crucifix protect me. I am still really enjoying the blood moons and stuff, and we still need to work on getting this, uh, you know, challenge done and getting the trophy for everyone, so hopefully there'll be a final push for this and we'll get it done, so I need to be playing a lot more too. Alright, I'm getting a little scared. Ah, the breaker. I didn't think about breaker. I had a feeling it may have gone out. Uh, well there goes my sanity. But I can get this all the way in here, so this will cover this whole floor. I hope. Yeah, good enough. We're gonna have to put it down. No EMF 5. You touch something over here. Are you here? Okay, so then that's not gonna... Oh, but it could be Onryo. Well, let's not light that again then. So it's either Yokai or Onryo. So the funny... Wow, how am I gonna test this? A Yokai... Would... Well, that's, actually, it's very easy to test. But a Yokai... Would, and this is that's the thing I need to figure out. A yokai won't hear you as if you're far away, or if, even if you're like right next to a yokai, it won't hear you. It's trying to tell me about Maple Lodge. I didn't even know there was a thing about Maple Lodge on here. So, uh, maybe I just need to get hunted. Drop this. Uh, wait. Let's do the Onryo test. Okay, I do have the crucifix and this. If I put this down, let's see if I've learned this game. I'm gonna put this down right on top. Now, if it uses the crucifix and this is not blown out, it is not non Rio. So now I just need to sit here until it uses the crucifix. So actually, the yokai test is if you're like talking or your whoa or your equipment is on, the yokai won't detect you unless it's like right next to you. So there's a way to test it. It didn't did throw the book. 
but that's like another thing so I kind of understand the miling now but now I need to like test the yokai and I understand that one it's just kind of harder to do and there are certain locations in each map where you can kind of stand and test it so I don't know that's a nightmare for you though learning all these extra things I don't know why this like <laughs> blanket being off the side <laughs> interested me all right well I'm just hoping why are you getting mad about maple lodge just leave that on there this thing I think I'm not gonna worry about that I want to try an actual nightmare test here and see if we get an on rio because if it blows it out and hunts it's definitely an on rio but if it blows it out and the crucifix is used I think it has the <laughs> uh, I don't know I just need to see what happens here with the crucifix I'm pretty sure if the crucifix gets used and it's not blown out it is not an on rio and if it gets blown out and the crucifix is used then it is an on rio I hope that's right so ultimately I just need to see what happens here and we need this crucifix to go off and so uh, I don't want it to happen when I'm not in here see okay so what is <laughs> does that mean anything I don't think that means anything we need we just need to keep going until it either blows out the candle and hunts instantly which would mean an onrio or until it uses up the crucifix and not the lantern oh god I'm gonna be like running in the dark down the stairs hopefully just hugging the wall will work this is such a demonic looking room with the candles and the dots and oh god I just need to sit here and wait I'd look for UV on there but there's no reason to unless you're a mimic oh wait you know what though there are ghost orbs I should be looking because a mimic could have fingerprints I don't think it's a mimic though I always for forget my own advice. <sighs> See, did it blow out? Ah, I wasn't paying attention. I was too busy getting the mimic. Ah, I wasn't paying attention. So I don't, I look back and it's out, but I didn't hear it go out. So now we have to do it again. So if this goes out and the crucifix is used, this is why we just need to stare at it like SpongeBob staring at that flower. I already have see it, it is blowing out I'm gonna guess on Rio just because of how much is blowing it out I gotta relight it I really should have my smudge because I'm oh my god I'm not even gonna be able to escape unless it somehow sees me I still don't think that means anything it needs to blow it out and use the crucifix I because it doesn't always blow it out and hunt, but when it blows out and hunts, the crucifix would go off. See, I, I'm just, I could be wrong here, so don't, this is me learning. <laughs> I'm supposed to know these things. I still, uh, it is blowing it out a lot, so, but maybe it's a yokai that's just trying to trick me. It just sucks that I turned around and the lantern was blown out and the crucifix was used and I didn't hear because I was too busy thinking about the mimic. But since we didn't get fingerprints, I don't think it's going to be a mimic, because that was the ever other evidence. Because the, the mimic could have. The mimic has UV spirit box. Let me just look. Okay, I'm gonna. But I think I've checked for the other evidence that could be a mimic. Can I like do this on the side here? I just want to see. Spirit box UV or freezing, so it's not been in any of those. Where, what about, well, what about freezing? I mean, it could be, since we got the orbs. I don't see my thermometer anymore. I'm really hoping that this, oh, there it is. Blends in with the floor. No, still not down to freezing. You haven't blown out the candle again. And you also haven't used the crucifix again, which surprises me. For as active as a ghost you are, I... I guess this is not an onrio because an onrio is supposed to blow out a candle then hunt and with how much is blown out the candle and not hunted I'm guessing it's a yokai we know already know it's not a mare yeah this it would have hunted like it's blown out the candles a lot but it would it would have hunted though like an onrio is supposed to blow out or it's supposed to hunt after blowing out candles or, and also there's like a thing where there's if there's more candles it's more powerful or something like that I, again, I'm still learning all these ghosts. 
It's like I kind of know the strategy, but not exactly everything. All right, well, this has been fun, trying to summon a hunt like this. We have the objective. I just need to survive now. But I'm going to go ahead and say this is not an Onryo, because I would have hunted in all those blowouts. So let's go get a smudge and try and end this. I think it just blew it out again, and it didn't hunt, so... Oh, there goes the crucifix. All right, let me get out of here then. Uh, I'm probably gonna come back in and immediately get hunted, which I kinda need. But this time, let me just go get a bunch of smudges. I'll even come back in with my main light, so I guess uh, I could use my headlamp and I have three smudges, or I could use the big light and have more vision, but only have two smudges. I, I think I'd be good with just two, so I don't know. Let's get the big light and just risk it with only two smudges. Okay. Oh, <laughs> damn it. Well, I can still get another one. I was trying to make sure I had everything, and then of course I hit the right click by accident. There. We have my light, though. We <laughs> definitely have the lighter. And two smudges to try and save me. Now I can get all the way... Whoa. Back to the first... There's that hunt. Back to the first floor. Let's just walk up the stairs and see if I run into this ghost. I'm gonna just creepily crawl up here. I don't want to waste my sprint. So let's just make this long and drawn out. I don't hear anything yet, though. See, I could try a yokai test, but you have to be on the same floor, and that's the hard part. I mean, let's try. If she comes down to this floor, I can try. I think she's done, though. I mean, that- oh. I think that would be a way to test a yokai, though. I think if she- hmm. I don't know, it's such a small map. It's so hard to test a yokai on a map with such small rooms like this. I'm just gonna assume that from the a million blown out candles and no hunts that it's not an Onryo. But somehow I gotta get this ghost to come down here. It's always on these staircases, you gotta smudge. Okay, I hear you. I don't even know if- if you're on another floor I don't even think it matters with this yokai. I hear you on the st stairs, that means you're going up. Okay, about to come around this corner. Okay. Mm, if you catch him like right here, I guess it's not too bad. I'm just gonna keep running. I'd say we did that, right? Please tell me that counted. Counted as escape? Yes, okay. Let's get it on out of here then. I'm not worried about photos at all. And unfortunately, I should be taking photos of these things, but right now I'm focusing on the actual nightmare difficulty and not taking these. So ultimately, me taking like four photos of these things is not going to amount to much. Hopefully, I'll just start playing this game a lot more and do a lot of more Blood Moons and try and actually help. So maybe we'll do a lot of Blood Moons on repeat and not necessarily a nightmare and just try and do the objectives and stuff. So we do need to do this a lot more and make sure we get this trophy this year. And the thing is, I don't even exactly know this is a yokai, but like, I've never had... I don't know how Onryos exactly work. Watch this be an Onryo. How would it... It what? How would it... I don't understand. I mean, it made sense with how much it blew it out. But, I don't understand how it could blow it out and not hunt. So, I, I, time to, you know, research Onryos. That's pretty much the point of nightmares. To like, once you try and... I don't know, get confused by a ghost, you then go out of your way to figure it out. So yeah, I'll look up an Onryo and try and figure out the proper Onryo hunt test or, you know, test for Nightmare. So if you're still here, thank you so much for watching. Remember to like and subscribe and I will see you all next time.